I will not keep silent. Holy fire in my blood covenant. Posted 23 March 2021, 514 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. Message received March 18th through the 22nd, 2021. I am coming, and I will not keep silent. A fire will devour before me, and a flame burns behind me as I am consuming fire. A mighty tempest is come, as the Lion of Judah, the Lord of hosts, is armed for battle and prepared to execute justice, raining fire on the wicked, as this will be the portion of their cup. Hear me, my people, my remnant, your day is come, for I will redeem you from among men. I must reign until I put all my enemies under my feet. I come with holy fire, as I have never come before. My fire will consume, it will judge, and it will separate. Every man's work will be made evident. My fire will also bathe all those who are mine in a fresh anointing, with a power and authority never before witnessed on the earth. My fire will bring terror to the hearts of men who have refused me, but it will bring great joy and release for those who walk in my ways and have prepared for my return. Miracles will occur, and you will proclaim my kingdom. You will bind the brokenhearted and set the prisoners free. You will comfort all who mourn and give hope to the hopeless. I have clothed you with the garments of salvation and covered you in my robe of righteousness. I have adorned you as my bride. The earth is bringing forth her bud, and the things which have been sown are to spring forth. Another great shift is occurring, and all will now change. Great upheaval will be seen in all aspects of life. It has already begun, but my remnant army are prepared, and they know this is the time I have been speaking to them about. Rise, my loves, rise and shine, for my fire and my glory will illuminate the darkest places and expose all things. I am pouring out in full measure for my wise virgins, those who have not strayed from the voice of their shepherd and king, and have forsaken all else to keep covenant with me. This covenant is my blood covenant, ratified on the cross of Calvary. Those in covenant with me have accepted my sacrifice, drank the cup in full measure that I have offered to them, surrendered all to me, no matter what the cost, and given their lives in full surrender, emptying themselves to become my vessels of righteousness. The great consummation of your marriage covenant is upon you. A threshing like no other is here, and I will take back those who are mine, my jewels, my precious ones. A tearing away is here, and I will be known upon the earth. I live forevermore, and I will make myself known to all men. I am the only son of the living God, Yahuwah. Not a soul will escape the great revealing that is upon you. I see the battle-weary hearts of my people, and I know your despair and weariness, but do not allow the enemy to discourage you. My plans for you are for good, and those in the blood covenant with me will not be harmed. You are sealed, and you bear my name. All of heaven has prepared for this awesome event, and many, many assist you from the unseen. You will witness such power and majesty, awe and wonder, when your king and your groom makes himself known in and through you, as I pour and I pour and I pour out my spirit upon my beautiful ones. A great and wonderful day is upon you, one you would not believe even if I told you. So rejoice and lift your hearts, lift your eyes, and lift your voices in high praises to the King, as I am prepared in all my glory to meet my bride, my espoused, and crown you as kings and priests. It is so close now. Stay near to me, my loves. Be silent before me. Keep your eyes heavenward and listen for the cry. 
for the trumpet will sound, and the orders will be given, and you will know such bliss in my presence. Then we will turn this world upside down as we exhibit kingdom presence, power, and authority as it has never been done before. Your faithfulness will be rewarded. My joy I give you, and the shalom that only I can give is yours. Abide in me fully, and know my approach is upon you. Yahushua, King, Groom, Mighty Warrior, Lion of Judah, Captain of the Host of Heaven's Army.